It's been a really long time since I got some stationary pieces, so I decided to get some rubber stamps from Journal Station. I was a bit sad because one of the stamps I wanted was sold out. It wasn't marked sold out at the time, so it went through the order process and then I got an email saying I was partially refunded. Um, I think I mentioned this in my previous video, but I was still really happy when I got my other stamps in the mail. And I always forget that shops send out freebies. So every time I open a package and see a smaller package with freebies, I'm super happy to look through them. Oh, and I also got some handmade pieces that I thought would be bigger, but that's okay because they're still really pretty. And I thought this calendar stamp will be a little bit bigger, but um, I don't know what I was thinking. I thought everything would just be big, I guess. No, I really enjoy the up close shots and so I just love the way this entire video turned out. I decided to get this little tiny house stamp because it was just really cute and I think it would add a nice home feeling to my future pages. One day though, I want to save up and be able to buy a full rubber stamp set. If I could, I would just buy everything from the site because everything is just really nice and pretty. And I never thought I would enjoy stamps this much, but they are really fun and add personality and character to your pages. So. I have a growing collection. And I've always wanted a bird stamp. Um, the ones that you see flying, I don't know how to describe them, but every time I check, they're sold out. So I got this one and I'm really happy with it. It's really pretty. And it came with a little feather.
of course I wanted to show you guys what it looks like on the handmade paper. about a week later my other stamp arrived and I decided to get a flower stamp and I'm really glad this one wasn't sold out uh, I actually expected this one to be smaller but I think it's really good size and I also got a new ink pad from jet pens I saw this color on journal station but it was sold out <laughs> um, but thankfully jet pens had it and it's really pretty color. It's called Aspen Mist. You'll actually hear my reaction in, in about a few minutes. But um, I gl I'm glad I got this ink pad. But I hope you guys I hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video. I don't know why I'm stumbling over my words. Um, hope you like it, and I will see you in my next one. Thank you for watching. Bye. Thank you.